Well, this just reminds me of our old house in winter time. I'm so sad, guys. Hey, y'all, it's Clay Leo. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I've got such a fun video. I've been so excited to film this video for you guys for such a long time. So before we get on to this video, first, let me tell you what it is. I'm going to be showing you guys some of my fall favorites. But before we get on to this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you love fall as much as I do. Fall is one of my favorite se seasons because it's not freezing cold, but it is a little bit colder, so you can dress up a little warmer, which is some clothes that I'm going to be showing you guys. <clears throat> and the food is amazing. I love fall food. And Halloween is a part of it, which means you get a buttload of candy. Hopefully, if you're good that year. So, without further ado, let's just get straight on to the video. I'm going to start off with my favorite topic. Tasties? No. Topic. Not topic. Category for fall, which is food. <sighs> I'm just so excited to show you guys. So, to start it off, I have got five different things for my fall favorite. So, to start it off, I have got two different types of cereals. Yes, you guys, I found pumpkin spice cereals. I've got with me one of my favorite cereals of all lifetime. Life cereal and it's pumpkin spice. I am in love with this. This tastes so good, you guys. I'll even try some for you. Mm. So good. I just can't get enough of this live cereal. Like, I was at Target, just shopping around, you know, minding my business, minding my own business, and all of a sudden, I see this cereal. The live cereal. I can't explain to you how much I love it, but I'm going to keep going. Next, I've got Pumpkin Spice Cheerios. I haven't tried this yet, but both of these are actually limited editions, so I'm going to have to go back to the store and buy like five more of these because these are so good and they need to last. Mm, so I'm going to open it and I'm going to try it and see if it's as good as the live cereal. Because, you know, live cereal can never... Whoa, they're orange. Look at that. Well, have you ever had that time, like, when you open up chips and they, like, poof with smell, like, <sighs> let's see if this does it. If I can open it. It smells like a gerbil cage. Oh, well, let's try some. A tear just fell down my eyes. Right. Out of my eyes. This is so good, you guys. It definitely has a lot of pumpkin taste in it. Or it might be cinnamon or nutmeg. But it is so good. I can't even explain it. Anyways, next. I have got super moist pumpkin spice cake mix. Oh! I am going to be baking this for my family, maybe tonight, because I just... Look at this! It looks so good! I've never tried pumpkin spice cake. For some reason it keeps reminding me of carrot cake, but this is probably way better. So, stay tuned on my Instagram to see us trying this, because I'm definitely going to be making this. Very soon. My nummies! Next, I have got pumpkin chocolate chip cookies. Yep, you heard right. Pumpkin chocolate chip cookies. What the heck? Pumpkin chocolate chip cookies. I've already gotten started on one, and they're delicious. But I have two different kinds, so I've got this one from Walmart. Yeah, it's from Walmart, but it's delicious. Mm. There's not as much pumpkin in it. Still good. Then I got this one from Meters. Meters. 
and I've also gotten started on it. Look at how, th how thick this is. It looks like a poop. No joke. So. This can't go wrong. It's literally the best cookie I've had in my life. I can die now because that was so good. And if you didn't think, and if you thought that that little Neater's cookie was enough, no. I've got this thick baby. This Neater's pumpkin bread. I'm just going to open it and smell it because I'm not even going to eat it yet because it's just too good to eat. Smells so good. Okay, you know what? Just taking a sneak little bite. No one will ever know because it's mine. No one's going to touch it. This right here, literally the best thing ever. Gotta put it away before I eat the whole thing because, yeah, I will eat the whole thing. Kidoki. So that's it for food. Now for candles. Heck yeah, I love candles. So I've got these two candles. I have got, where's the, this mold cider, which not mold cider, mold, M-U-L-L-E-D. Smells so good, you guys. Literally can't wait to use it. Actually, I already have used it. And this pumpkin spice one. Oh, I'm going to cry. It's so good. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. It's a candle. This smells delicious, guys. There's that one. And then we got the pumpkin spice one. I'm not sure which one I like more. They both... Smells super good, but I gotta say for taste, I definitely, <gasps> apple cider. So good, guys, I'm gonna die. Well, anyways, I've gotta say pumpkin spice bread and pumpkin spice Cheerios and life cereal. It's good. But mold cider is my favorite smelling candle. It's so good. Okay, <laughs> now on to clothes. So like I said, fall it kind of starts getting a little colder and that is when I wear boots and long jeans which actually I don't wear shorts much which is kind of weird because where we live it's super hot but anyways let's get started on shoes I have got three different pairs of shoes my per for my first pair first pair my first pair these are from Walmart yes they're from Walmart and they're a little bit bent from when from trap from being in the the storage room or storage unit but these are super cute they definitely look remind me of fall or winter boots they've got this oh this just reminds me of our old house in winter time I'm so sad guys literally I'm so sad right now anyways so there's these shoes these are from Walmart the next thing are these cute boots these are from Costco actually I found them at Costco and I thought they're so cute and super cheap, so I bought them. But they're really cute, especially for winter time. They're ankle boots, I guess, and they're brown, which is perfect for fall. Next, we've got these boots, which I also got from Walmart, surprisingly. And I just love these because they're also boots, and I feel like boots is definitely a very fall time that makes sense a very definitely a fall clothing item now for sweaters I love sweaters and sweatshirts so I've got this big one which is so cute it's this little it's like a velvet knit I guess you could say and I got this from Old Navy nope from Gap got this from Gap there was one in pink but I wasn't able to get it because the only one had like a hole in it or it was something. And I've got this baby. Yep, just keeps going. Just kidding. And this is very long. See? And I love this because it can be like a blanket. Like, look. I mean, it's not obviously very cute to be a blanket, but it can be a blanket as well as a cute cardigan. And I just love this because it's cardigan weather, you know? Just gotta embrace that. Yep, that's all I gotta say. Now, fall is definitely very yellow, orange, brown, 
dark green, wait, dark green type of color. So I've got lots of, or wow, it's very hot now actually. Whew, okay. So I have got a few yellow shirts that I love, especially for fall. I got this one, which is very simple. It's super duper cute. I got this from H&M. Then I have got this flannel, which I actually haven't worn yet, see? There is still a tag. But I think that this is just super duper cute. Definitely fall colors, brown, black, red, and yellow, or like an orange yellow. And I got this from, I think it was Macy's. Actually, nope. I got this from Forever 21. Then we've got this shirt, which I got from Pink Desert, which was for one of my brand deals. And I just love this because it's definitely very fall. I can wear it under like a jumpsuit like this. It's just super cute. Last but not least, I have got this sweater. Oh, this reminds me of my grandma's house when I got it. So many memories, you guys. It makes me so sad. I'm not even kidding. Hmm. I want to go back to the old days. Okay. Well, anyways, this I just love because it's very cute. There is a turtleneck, which is a little bit different, but it just screams fall. And yeah. Kaboom. So that is all for my fall favorites. I hope y'all love this as much as I did. Comment down below. Out of all of this stuff, your favorite. Maybe out of each category. So out of food, candles, which there's only two, but out of candles and then clothes. Out of all those, what was your favorite? Make sure to turn on your notifications to join my Clay Bay Squad, because I keep telling you this, but I've got so many fun videos planned. I'm so excited to film them for you guys and edit them and get them up for you guys, so turn on your notifications and make sure to subscribe down below to join my Clay Bay Squad, because I love you all so much and you guys are all so amazing. Thank you so much for everything you guys have done and make sure to follow my Instagram. Till next time, I love y'all so much. Bye. Thank you.